Rush is the street and Jilly's is the place as we visit with Stan Wozniak. All right, you know what? It's no? Yeah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. You know, here we are celebrating. I'm with one of the nicest guys in Chicago, Stan the Woz Wozniak. Yes. And, and if we kind of runs Rush Street now, but hey, let's talk you. about Rush Street. I mean, give me a little tour of Rush Street. What's going on here? Rush Street. Oh, it's the greatest street in the, in the entire country at this point in our lives. I mean, it's never been like this before. I, Back in its heyday, I don't think it was as strong as it's been, it is now. We've got uh, Gibson's, of course, the old mainstay that's been here for nine, ten years now. It's busier than ever. And then you open Hugo's, and then you have uh, Carmine's Clam House, Tavern on Rush, the Whiskey Bar, which is owned by uh, Randy Gerber and uh, his wife, Sydney, Sydney Crawford. Sydney Crawford. He, 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 he was Bobby, uh, Bobby Gerber. He was raised on what kind of baby food was that? <laughs> Oh, no, yeah. I think it's the same spelling now. Yeah. And then, of course, we've got uh, our establishments, uh, Julie's Bistro, the piano bar, and then Julie's... Well, no, wait, which was first? The... Julie's, uh, the piano bar, Julie's piano bar was first. It was, it's been open uh, four and a half years now. And then, uh, um, after that, about two years after that opened, we opened uh, Julie's Retro, which is a 70s disco dance club. Okay. And then, uh, about... Uh, three Come. months ago, two months ago, whatever it may have been, we opened uh, Julie's, uh, an Italian steakhouse. And you got Bobby Walsh as your chef. Bobby Who's... Walsh uh, um, is, is our executive chef uh, and partner, um, doing a great, great job. He's had a lot of experience with this food. He used to be the executive chef for uh, the World Cup group at that at one point. Okay, so let's do this because you know it's winter time. It's called. Uh, it's the coldest day of the year. You know, but yeah. so let's go inside and we'll get. Smile. <laughs> okay, big smile to the camera, hey. And we'll talk about his illustrious career. Come on. Oh. It's a little hey. warmer inside. Stanley's fixed it himself up here. And you know, I gotta ask you a question. When so many places fail on this street, what is it about your clubs downstairs and next door that are like, you know, they're lined up out the door when it's cold? Uh, luck, for the most part. Uh, it's lucky, you know. <laughs> luck has got a, a little bit to do with it, and then uh, timing, of course. The, the street have just come back so big, better than it's ever been before. So we were at the right place at the right time, and uh, and I think we have a high repeat in our customer base because we, we we really treat every customer as a VIP. We really take care of them. Except for me when I come in on Friday night. Oh, we don't like you, Dave. That's, Thank you. Know, that's okay. The place is doing gangbusters. There's a line out there. We actually had to wait to get it in tape tonight because it was so crowded. Um, tell me about the restaurant. The restaurant, uh, which is currently about uh, four weeks old now, um, is in an uh, Italian steakhouse. Um, basically, Italian food with steaks. Okay. Um, and our executive chef, uh, Bobby Walsh, who just came over, and uh, this is the magic is his. All right, we're here with Bobby No Name Walsh. And I don't know what to say. It's so late at night. We, it's like 12 o'clock here. The place is still crowded. Tell me about the food a little bit. This is um, the traditional caprese salad with the roasted shallot, vinaigrette, chopped basil on top of it, vine ripe tomatoes with fresh mozzarella. Um, that's the number one, number one seller here for an appetizer. Sure. That and the fried calamari. We have carpaccio, which is beef tenderloin. With, very um, thin, cut very thin. Cut very thin with drizzled with some virgin olive oil. Mescaline salad, which is California baby greens and shaved Reggiano cheese on top of it. This is a very traditional Chicago dish, porterhouse Vesuvio style. A lot of people do um, New York's or whatever. This is a big, hearty steak. Okay. And uh, it's done Vesuvio style. And like I said, all our steaks are prime. They're delicious. Mm. Right? I've had this before. It was great. <laughs> uh, and then we have risotto. I have three or four different risottos on the menu. I do a couple specials uh, every night with the risotto. Uh, wow. Now that we're going into fall, I'll be doing more risottos, doing some more heavier foods, asabucos. Let's see if we can get Stanley to smile. <laughs> Pretty good, Chef. <laughs> Tell me a little bit maybe about some of Chili's mystique. And we've only been open four weeks, but we're doing some, some very good business. I think the fact that they can come in here, you can get on an elevator, go downstairs, and beat that black long line to go into the hottest club in the city. 
Which is cool. Yeah, it's great. So yeah, we're right above idea. it. Yeah, okay. You know, you come in, you eat great. Uh, I love to see the dining room full. Everybody's tasting each other's food. Then they all go downstairs and, and drink Probably and dance. Probably for me to argue with the chef, but, you know. Okay. I think that that's, um, I think that's a, one of the big draws of the restaurant right now, besides the food. And it's just getting, it's, I see the trend is getting more and more. And it, it's nice. It's a good clientele. Where do you want to see this place a year from now? Where do I want to see it? Yeah. Lines outside like the club downstairs. All right. Can't All right, here's what I want you to do. Bobby, look at the camera. Yes. Tell them what's your phone number, what's your address, and when are you open? Our phone number here is 312-664-2100. We are open seven days a week from 5 in the evening until midnight, Friday and Saturday until 1 in the morning. So if you want a late night dinner or a late night snack, you can come in. We get a lot of people from downstairs while they're waiting for their car to come in and have some appetizers and their car pulls up and they leave. So we're here seven days a week, though. Salute. Hey. hey, buddy. Thanks, Dave. I really appreciate it. My that. pleasure. Really you know what? And it's yeah. good to see you, and I'll see you at the nice club to tomorrow night, all right? Great. Okay. David, Bobby, thanks. Yeah, always a pleasure. Great. See you, man. Okay. Bye-bye. All right. I'm glad that's over with, sure. man. You always hug the camera, Bobby. No, it's my culinary show. Let's get back to the f***ing. You want to do the pots or pans or the